Good evening, Welcome everyone. to Hi. Gibraltar. And uh, we thought... We have sun! Way. We thought we'd do a lovely sunset evening um, walk around one of my favourite places in the entire world. I know it's not everyone's cup of tea, but, you know, it was actually Gabby that introduced me to Gibraltar. And ever since she introduced me to Gibraltar... You never turned back. No, I've never turned back. Um, it's Britain by the sea. Although, you know, you know, you see these documentaries on Channel 5 about Gibraltar being Britain by the sea, but actually, it's still very Spanish. I feel like it's 50-50. It's 50-50, yeah. but a lot, of the, um, a lot of the workers, especially, are Spanish, and they don't know any English either, which you might be surprised, because you think, well, I'm, yeah. I'm in a British overseas territory, I'm going to go to a restaurant, I'm going to go to a, um, a shop, and then they go, sorry, no English. Unless yeah. they're, they're taking the mic. After we, we ordered a coffee, went to the other side of the rock um, yeah. earlier today and we ordered two coffees and I was asking for non-dairy and I had to put my Spanish skills to the, to the test. Yeah, but they didn't even, rec they didn't yeah. even understand. When you put your Spanish... When I, when I you put your... I'll be respectful, I'll speak English. Can didn't. I ask a question though? Because it is around about 24 degrees. Why on earth have you got this on? But you're going to a Tim, job interview. I'm Mediterranean blooded. What, you find it cold? Mm, Already? There can be a chilly winds <laughs> in the evening. She has just put me straight there. Um, by the way, just want to apologise as well. We were supposed to go live at 7, but I delayed it till 7.30. That's because Gabby... Can I ask you a quick question, Tim? Yeah, go for it. How many degrees did you say it was again? About 24. So why do you choose to wear black? You do know that black attracts the sun. Yeah, but it's it's evening. The air temperature we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, but the sun hasn't gone down yet. You you have no argument here, darling. But I'm not I'm not moaning. I'm just saying I, I'm surprised. I thought you'd want to feel the air on your skin because it's nice and warm. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's continue. Anyway, let's say hello to people in the chat. Um, Are you going on the David, break off or what? David NM, hello to Sue, evening, hello to Amber, Bobby's here as well, Ricardo, Freedom Seekers, hello to Liam, Belvedere is in the chat, uh, Ali McNally, David NM, I think I've said that, Craig, hello to Leslie, Stephen Brown, good evening, uh, Tina, hello to John, hello to Dat Guy, hi Timmy Gabs, can I have a... Huge shout out to my beautiful fiance. We're on holiday in Benidorm. Wow. And have been recreating your video. All Hollister everything. Eh? By the way, talking of Benidorm, I will I will be returning to is Benidorm that very logo? soon. Yeah. Oh. This is. Oh. I will be returning. I will be returning to Benidorm in a uh, in a few weeks to do some more videos and we may do a live there but Gabby won't be joining me unfortunately. Why is Hi your... Kieran Northcott. Why is your internet not working? That's I don't know. Did you? Re yeah, restart your phone and do something like that. Oh, it's because it's reconnected to the sun. <laughs> so what I'm going to do before we do anything, okay, and make sure that after you've watched the live, you check out my tour of Gibraltar, my exclusive tour of Gibraltar. And I do everything. I go up the rock. I check out the beaches. Yes, there are beaches here in Gibraltar. It has fabulous weather. You get all your home comforts. Did you know that there's a Morrison's here? It's the only Morrison's outside of the UK. Yeah. And also, what's that other shop we went to? Um, Uroski. Uroski, which is Spanish. But here on The Rock, they've got all the English brands as well as the, uh, the Spanish. So you get the best, best of both worlds. And when I'm talking about that, I'm talking about the proper Spanish uh, fresh fish and the uh, the meats that you get as well. You know that meat that kind of, well, a lot of people don't like that, that dried meat that hangs down and like dribbles, but wow, you mean, like, it tastes pig's nice. legs and stuff? Yeah, that kind of stuff. Well, you just say it. It is what it is. So, uh, is it pig's legs? I think it is. Is that what it is? Yeah, well, it oh is Oh my God, animals. I'm never eating it again. It is what it is. <laughs> Hello to Stu. Sorry, we'll, we'll catch up with some of the chat as well as we start walking, but we're going to go and have a walk through we the centre of Gibraltar, first? around to see the sunset as well, and then back around again. We'll tell you as well, a video coming up that we're staying in tonight, um, a very nice hotel. Yeah, sorry Gabby. Do yeah, give the video a thumbs up as well. Yeah, I some shout outs. Um, yeah, I did do some shout outs. Though. When? Where were you when I was just doing it? I didn't know you were saying it. I just weren't listening to him. Oh my god, I feel so bad. Um, did you say about Sharon being... No, I didn't. Been well, then you didn't months, do Sharon. enough, did you? Sharon, 
Well done. Congratulations for being a member for eight months. Amazing. Hi, Tim and Gabby. Hi to you, Sharon. Wendy lived in Gibraltar us. many moons ago. Hello from Luxembourg. Uh, Anna, thank you uh, very uh, much oh, for your... Yeah. Um, your super chat, Hannah. Yes, it was our yeah, anniversary. Was. We've just, we've just literally yesterday celebrated ten years of marriage. To be fair, we didn't really do a lot yesterday to celebrate it, but as a whole, this whole getaway is the celebration of the anniversary. So, we're we've been doing a lot today. It's been a bit of both, to be honest, because we've been tomorrow. working, or I've been working. It's a work event. It's work a work anniversary. <laughs> Anniversary. No, they can't be the same thing. <laughs> I Grab work a, a 10 years anniversary. And you haven't. No, I haven't. No. He hasn't. Is it a travel lodge? No, Nick, it's not a travel lodge. Um, no. Are you staying on the Sunborn? We might be. Joey B, 17 months. Wow, that's fact, you insane. Can't see no. Hi, Tim and Gabby. Hope you're all having a great holiday. Well, it's you not really a holiday as such. It is a little getaway, but it's a work getaway. It's a work anniversary getaway, work a getaway. So, getaway? If, yeah. if we're going to talk about Gibraltar a lot, obviously, because we're here. And if you've never been to Gibraltar, you are missing out. Cheap flights, although the airport was closed today because of. And a you do have to strike. fly from Gatwick. You can't fly Luton anymore, which is seriously you're not. disappointing. That's why you flew Gatwick, darling. Yeah, I and mean, you can't fly Stansted. But if you're willing you to never go could to Gatwick. Fly Stansted. You can fly to Gibraltar. Now, flights are cheap. Uh, the hotels here, they're not overly cheap, but we stayed in a Holiday Inn Express last night. And if you haven't seen my YouTube short of where we stayed, it was it was literally by a graveyard. And when we yeah. say a graveyard, wow, was yeah. it by a graveyard? Um, if you go onto my channel and hit shorts, you'll see exactly what I mean. Yeah, so we were actually given a room on the graveyard side and then <laughs> Tim, Tim said to the personal reception can you move us to the rock view because I'm scared <laughs> uh, is there a Costa yeah. coffee there Andrew I of said, course don't worry, there I'll is. hold your hand yes there isn't an Asda but there is a there Morrison's is a there's a Morrison's here yeah and there's like three Matalans there is. There's all the British shops. We'll go and show mm -hmm. you those. We're going to go and start walking. Thumbs is with us as well. Craig, thank you so much for your super chat. Love you thank guys. You, Craig. Thank you, Craig. We love you too. I'll just show you the view we've got right now. Look at the sunset. Are you ready to go, darling? I am. Amber, thank you so much. Happy 10th anniversary and 13 happy years together. Oh, Amber, you've been paying attention. Yeah, 13 years together. That's right. Thank you very much. I remember the last time I've done two. Oh, well, how many degrees did you say it was? 24. Oh. Oh, so right. That was just for the intro, guys. Wow. I am sweating. Are you really? Yeah. Uh, we'll get more of the sunset as well in a moment, and hopefully I'll time it right as we go up towards we the pool. We did port. good with that, didn't we? Though? My uncle's is in Spain. He's in Jerez. <gasps> Sack the juggler. Someone's just smashed the glass. We're Julie not... C, happy anniversary to you both. Thank you so much for your super chat, Julie. Thank you, Julie. We're not going near the monkeys. The monkeys are literally up the rock. Oh, did you get Craig Eats? Craigie, no I didn't. Craigie? Craig E, you're back. I Hello, haven't Craigie. seen Craigie for ages. Hi to me, Gabby. Either. You missed my joke. Dwayne Johnson wants to move to a peninsula south of Spain. He wants to be the rock of Gibraltar. Oh, brilliant. Oh, yeah, I love that one. <laughs> what a joke. See, people are out here well. having a nice drink and a bit of a tipple oh. this evening. Uh, Preaky. Prikey, Prikey, Prikey. 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 thank you, you very so much. much. Appreciate that. Is it Prikey? Thank Prikey? you so much. Uh, Mar Mar Marcia, I'm so glad I found your channel. You make me smile. Thanks, Marcia. I hate uh, that. Uh, I hate the monkeys, yeah. No, I don't hate the monkeys. Oh, thank you. Alice of Eden, I love your videos, guys. Thank you, very good. Right, let's show much. them the cost of property around here. It's got to be done. Andrew, thanks. I appreciate that. I remember the last oh. time I was in Gibraltar. This is where I was. It was I so feel. hot the pool with the sunbeds up here. Up here? No, I was telling you, I saw sunbeds at the pool. What, on this one? Up here. Oh, no, 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 they weren't here. Yeah, I said I saw people sunbathing. Oh, right. Yeah. Is Casper with you? He is, look. If you look down, you wouldn't believe it. I'm actually pushing little thumps. Now today, Thumpies has been in the swimming pool, haven't you, darling? Yeah. <laughs> Are you tired? Look, he's wearing his, he's got a little red top, which I'm gonna, I was gonna wear for the live, but he's got a little red top and I've got a red top. We're gonna both wear it tomorrow night and look cool. Is that and all right, Bumps? If anyone's wondering, we do need to hire this. This goes higher, but we haven't done it yet because we haven't had a chance to get hold of the There is no Starbucks, driver. no. 
There isn't in Starbucks. We were surprised. No, but there's plenty of lovely places. Check out the property prices. Yeah, if you think Gibraltar's... Which one should we go to? Property oh, this I don't one. Know. If you think Gibraltar's cheap, then you're really wrong because it's actually really expensive. Just to rent an apartment, for example, like look at this one, right? If you want to rent this, you get a lovely view of the, the harbour. It's 4,000 a month per calendar month. Something like that, which is really small, 2,000. Ridiculous. Although I do like that, but they've, they've kind of taken a photo of the- Balcony? The balcony, outside like a, living. Uh, yeah, like, like a conservatory balcony. 1,500 a month. That's some people's hey, mortgage. that one looks really nice. How much is that? I mean, 6, that is like a celebrity's That's place. a penthouse, so. Penthouse Midtown. Yeah, we've got to move because we'll miss the sunset otherwise. No, they really have developed this place, haven't they? We Foxy have because Bee we... has been a member for 20 months. Very Thanks, happy Foxy to be the family here. Yeah, Foxy, you're doing well on both our channels. We, were we just, love you. We were just saying that Ocean Village has been... You, It wasn't here when you were younger, when you came to Gibraltar. No, this is all new. This is not how I remember it. Do they do, <laughs> do, they do twiglets? Yes, they do every British food out here. And I tell you what, I was gonna buy some chocolate today and it was 50p for a Twix. Yeah. Something smells good. I was gonna say the same, something smells really good. So, um, somebody has also asked, is there a Nando's here? I'm not sure, there's like a Pizza Express. No, there's a Burger King as well. There's a Wagamama's. There is a Wagamama's. Have you passed that? If you remember, I did a live um, a couple of years ago down there where I showed my credit card. The what? So this place, what? You can buy bottles of wine here, but you can also... Oh, right. This is Gabby's kind of shop. Yeah. Do they do wine tasting? It looks like Should we go in and ask him? Look, go in and ask him. Do you do wine tasting? Do you do wine tasting? Oh, he's got the person. I thought he was... wine, he's having a beer. I thought, I thought he was the owner. I don't think he is. <laughs> this was really randomly saying to that guy, do you do wine tasting? And he was like, yeah, I'm not, you, nothing like, hey, to do I'm with me. I'm drinking a wine, I'm having a beer, mate. Uh, but Moria, thanks very much. Happy oh, anniversary, best you. channel by Mark. That's very kind of you. Oh, thank you. Um, are we going to stop by any, any drinks today? We might do by the end, well, if you depends. stay with us. Do you want us to or do you not want us to? Hey, I'm not refusing one. We are an hour ahead of the UK, so local time in Gibraltar is quarter to nine. Yeah, so we have already had one. But we will, we will show you all the British shops they've got here as we walk through the town. They've got a lot of cannons in Gibraltar, haven't they? Yes. I love that. Somebody just swore. Let's hope that doesn't get me demonetised. They said the F... No, they said the F word. I lived in Gibraltar, uh, Gibraltar, Gibraltar at Europa Pass. It's looking like they've done, they have done a lot. Where is it at 11.32 I just saw? Emma Jones, welcome to the family. They've done, the, just joined. look at that, Thank there's you. quite a lot. We've got a thousand people watching. Hit the thumbs up, it does help us out. So Gabby, we're, had it, we're heading to, what's it called? Because you called it something Ca else. Cass Square? Cass, 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 Cass Cassie Mate Square or Cass Mate Square. Cass Square. Whatever you want to call it. We're just leaving the uh, Ocean Village right now. So when we arrived yesterday, the first thing we did is we went to have lunch. Well, when I say lunch, we had it Spanish style. We had tapas. Oh yeah, we did. Love them. So we had that and a glass of wine in the square, and it was so nice. It was so hot yesterday, like mega hot, weren't it? it How was many really degrees was it yesterday? Um, like I was not expecting well, it to be at, that hot. Well, at, at about eight o'clock, we eight o'clock we tried to have an early night because of thumps. It didn't work out. Eight o'clock last night here in Gibraltar. No, don't stop me, darling. It was uh, twenty-seven degrees. It was very warm. Hang on, we need to. We need. Oh, to... there's a cross in there. We no, can... there's no cars coming. We can All cross. Right. See, this is my kind of bar. I like these bars. Thank you, Tom. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah, these, the typical, well, they're Spanish not Spanish, bars. but they're not, not, how can you say a Spanish bar in Gibraltar? Because it's 50-50 really, isn't it? I'm, it? It is. That is the rock of Gibraltar. From this angle, it doesn't look as epic as it does from the other side, does it? But you can see some um, hotels and, uh, well, actually, no, these are uh, apartments. 
So there's like a little fort up there. There is. Now, <laughs> if if you want to, I think I've pinned it at the top of the chat. And I think I've pinned it, well I haven't pinned it, but it's in the comments, uh, not in the comments, in the description. After the live, if you want to see my full tour of Gibraltar, make sure you do. But uh, I go up to see the monkeys. The monkeys just live up there all the time. They're just walking around the roads, off the trees, they're everywhere. And they're very yeah. friendly. But they'll nick all your food, won't they? Yes. They don't care. Do you Brit know? British, British look, British through and through. Yeah, everyone's going to be really frustrated with us, aren't they? Aren't they? <laughs> Now, obviously, Gibraltar has a massive um, military past and it is still very active today. And you can still see the old batteries and uh, where we're heading to now, it's a little bit uh, morbid to say, but it was the site of where um, execution, well, kind of executions happened with soldiers and stuff like that. You'll see outside the gate just here as we head inside. But there's also um, all these houses up there where I've got lost countless times. We do have red oh, buses in Gibraltar as well. Right here, right now. It does smell nice. Everything is British. The road signs, the Pelican Crossing. The buses are like the London buses. Even the bus stops have that, um, hang on, I'll show you. They have that the uh, okay. that bus stop sign in Gibraltar. Is Gibraltar bigger than Morocco? No. No. They um, did, John. They Andy did. Mullaney says congratulations on your anniversary. Thanks, Andy. Um, We're heading into Castmate Square. But do they drive on the other side of the road? Am I getting confused? Sorry? <laughs> Sarah says she wants to see a red post box. There was actually one just well, outside. No, the no, airport. no. I'll show, I'll show you some just down here. Castmate Square. Here we go. Weird to say, but I, I, I do like it in here. I get strange vibes in here. I always have. Don't items. The weirdest thing is, is here, oh, by the way, the police station looks very British. Look at the police station. I mean, this is something you definitely see in the UK with the bricks and everything. Not that if you've been to a police station before, you'll you'll know what I mean. But then that I bit. Like it in the square, isn't it? They still do a lot of um, military stuff in the square. Do you know what I think? By the way, we're walking up to the point of where they used to do uh, hangings. hangings. I, I think this square would have been really, really busy right now if it wasn't for the fact they've got the new ocean um, place. Well, oh, this is the only place that. to go then. Oh, yeah. God, Gabby, don't walk. You're going to walk over it. Are you going to walk over it? Don't do it. Should I not? Now, I don't know if I'm... I'm just looked at old historic... Did you ask us? I've looked at old historic photos and it looks like it would have been there, but I don't know. Uh, Jenny, if we converted it to Fahrenheit, I think it would be upper 70s. I don't really get a weird feeling, though. I'm surprised you don't. But yeah, there's loads of little restaurants here. They do close quite early, though, don't they? They have lots of fish and chips as well. So my dad tells me... Oh, let's just quickly show them this bit up here before the signal goes. Yeah, sorry, Gary. No, my dad tells me that the best fish and chips in Gibraltar is Charlie's. Where is that? I don't know, we need to look. Leanne Spampamato, thanks very much for the super chat. Where is that? I can't see that. Hang on. What does that say? Hey, looking looking for a boat going to the Canary Islands. If you weed? If you weed? If you weed a person, oh you're bored, send me a message on WhatsApp. We shouldn't probably put it on there, but he's put his little, he's put little face on there. Oh, I think that's an end for needs. That's not weed. Well, there you, you go. Weed. If you want to go from Gibraltar to the Canary Islands, which actually isn't too... F I don't know how many miles it is. Someone will tell me in the chat how far it is. 1.1k watches. Thank you, Ellen. Give us a thumbs up, everyone. That would be absolutely amazing. My granddad done his national service in Gibraltar. Aww. Respect. I done the hell. Uh, we're going to lose signal down here. But basically, 
because well it's going under underground but literally if you go through there you can literally walk through all of these little I spanish you streets there when we first came didn't I? yeah it's they're really nice and literally i came up there once um with a bike <laughs> stupidly after being from the rock and i tried to come down here and it was horrendous but it feels very spanishy up there and i shouldn't say that gibraltarians will wear will won't like that but yeah it's very spanishy <laughs> sorry thumps there's a curb there tim get it <laughs> <laughs> go to morrison's um we're not well i don't know if we're walking that far but there you go, Casbate Square in the sunset. Sent, uh, a super chat, thank you very much. Hi to you both. Hi to you, Christine, and thanks for joining us. Um, Cass says, I'm sat under the silver parasol. Give me away. Which silver parasol? Silver parasol? She might just be saying that. Are you doing a travel video or not? Thomas, What's I'm here to film. Um, if you want to see my travel video on Gibraltar, it's on the channel. It's also at the top of the chat. I've pinned it. I don't know. You could be there forever, darling. Well, I would wait, but I don't know what anyone's looking out for a wait. Calvin, wow, thank you so much. Looks lovely. A mini getaway is a getaway, regardless of working or not. Enjoy, pick up something from the Morrisons. <laughs> Wow, thank you so thank much. You. We definitely will. Do you know what? He's absolutely right. A change of scenery is great, whether it's work or not. I... There... Oh, there's... Is that Roy's? That's Roy's. Dad said Charlie's. All oh, right, Charlie's. Okay. Have... By the way, it might be um, British overseas. They have a Burger King, but it is the uh, Spanish menu because you can't get this in England which is, uh, I'm trying to, uh, I want to try this, but the cheesy Dorito um, burger looks insane. But yeah, look, they've got the traditional British signs. They've got the up, they've got pizza hearts. But you don't get banana plants in the UK, do you, Gabby? No, because we don't have the weather, although last summer was a little bit crazy. So somebody wanted to see the British um, post box here in Gibraltar. There it is, the red one. And there is the sign. We'll just actually show you on the map where we are, just by the red telephone box. Look at that. So, literally, we started off in Ocean Village and we're now um, there. And we're going to walk all the way down here towards the harbour, which is there, to check out the, um, the sunset and then go back around. But literally, look, the airport is just there. And if you know anything about Gibraltar, it's apparently the world's most dangerous airport. Not only because you have to walk over it, but because the way the rock is and the wind shear, and because of Spanish airspace, the way the aircraft have to come in, that's why it's classed as the most dangerous airport in the world. But Gabby was fine coming in. Do you know what? You, <laughs> you were. not even know I had a fear of flying. I just got on with it. Jacob, like, Whatever. a good question. They don't have a weather spoons, which is really interesting, isn't it? Why don't they have I a weather I don't know, spoons? but they've got loads of like traditional like British pubs here, like Irish. They've got Irish bars and they've got other sort of British pubs. It's... <clears throat> but this is what does my head in because, yes, right now we could be literally on any, any British street in the UK. Yeah. You I see mean, by the bins. The other day, that adventure in. But then ev yesterday, but, but if you look up, you get to see, although it's not necessarily Spanish architecture, but with the blinds and the uh... Mediterranean vibe. Yeah, you do. Um, Sophie says it looks like a nice place to go on holiday. Yeah, it, it is. Hang on, I um, said it was 24. That's saying it's 23. Oh, I was well, that I'll put close. My jacket back on. Oh yeah, Gabby, they've got the smallest Matalan in the world here. Yes, they do. We don't know if that's official, but we're yeah, saying Yeah, but you it know is. why? I realised when I went to bed last night, I kept focusing about it. I don't know why. Did um, you? you know, women and shopping and stuff like that. Did you really? Yeah, You're joking! Did. No, I'm not joking. Did you really God, think about... People have got serious issues. He wanted to be on the vlog. Um, Teddy, thanks very much. Hi guys, can you say hello to Teddy and... That vodka did Bryony. not agree with him. Did he have vodka? That's something. First of the British shops, look, Boo Avenue. Gabby likes to shop in there. That's I rude. do when my boobs are a normal size. 
Um, no, what I was going to say is the mini Matalan. Thank you very much, Craig. Because it was selling baby clothes. That's why it's miniature. It just sold baby clothes, didn't it? Yeah. So, Teddy Halls, thank you so much. Hey, guys, would you say hi to Teddy and Brianna, please? Hello to you both, and thank you for watching. Nice to have you on board. 1.2k watching, hit the thumbs, guys. It'd be absolutely amazing so, if you could do that. So, obviously, first. yeah, I was just going to say it does help if you hit the thumbs up. What? Nice little lit up restaurant down there. That looks well cute. I love that. We do love our little Spanish streets. We and, love the little, uh, and the tapas. little tiny. But we're not in rooms. Spain. No. And I and I mistakenly once said, well, we are in theory, but we're not. We're 50 50. <laughs> no, we're not. Gibraltarians are not Spanish, they're not English, they're Gibraltarians. Well, yeah, but we know that. They Leanne speak Spanish and they speak English. Uh, when will you guys go to Barcelona again? We haven't been to Barcelona yet. Yeah, I do yeah, want to take no, to, Bar uh, yeah. Gabby to Barcelona. I've been to Gibraltar on a cruise and it's lovely there. Do you know what? A lot of people come to Gibraltar and they don't realise that it has beaches. Gabby has it been does. coming here for how long? Yeah, but when I come here, it's a fine visit. I come down with the family and we literally just come to the shops, go and have a coffee but I can't and go. Believe we I don't come for beaches. I showed you beaches, didn't I? You did show me beaches. There were some nice beaches in Gibraltar. You'd be very surprised around the rock. It, I mean, that's what I mean. It's, it has everything you want. It's got Amber, British shops, Amber says they've beaches, got um, British the weather. looking um, lampposts as well. Yes, they do. And the bins. Very British. In fact, it must be bin day, right? Because all the rubbish <laughs> is absolutely everywhere at the minute. Kieran, hi to you. I thought we already said hi to you this evening, Kieran. Rebecca or says hi, Casper. Thanks, hi. Rebecca. Thanks for watching. Do you guys enjoy eating cauliflower? What? What a <laughs> random question. How long is the flight? The flight's Did normally... you see any cauliflower in my Tesco's hall? The flight's normally no. about three hours, <laughs> but it took us two hours to get here. Two and a half hours, actually. We had quite a tailwind. I think. Was it right? Two and a half hours? Yeah, it was really good because usually it's around about three hours, isn't it? So I was like, when he said it's going to be two and a half hours, I was like, yes, get in. So, now, yeah. but, obviously, which means it could be longer going back. We're, they've been celebrating the coronation here in Gibraltar. Hi, Lisa Pryor. Thank you for joining. See that post office there, look, it actually says uh, Scotland on the bottom Ooh. of it. Are you ready for the smallest Matalan in the world? Gabby, honestly, this, this place is brilliant. If you like Matalan, you need, you need to come here. It's even got a lift that goes to the first floor. Yeah, <laughs> this yeah. is the smallest. I mean, it's, it's strange, isn't it? Because like, I've always known a Matalan to be like on an industrial estate or something like yeah. that. I've never really seen one down a high street apart from Smallest here. Matalan in the world. And definitely not that small. Unless I just haven't been to the right towns, I don't know. Now we have to say we don't know if it's officially the smallest, but... Wendy, thank you for joining Walk With Me Beginner. So nice to have you on. Oh yeah, if you want to join wow. channel membership, wow. details Amazing. are in the description. Thanks for that. Thank you. Thank you, Life on the Ocean Wave, and thanks for the support on the channel as well. Appreciate it. I'm sorry I missed you when I was in Blackpool recently. Crispy, a Walk With Me Pro, a member for 19 months. Now that, that is dedication. Now that is dedication, Crispy. Evening, everyone. Just finished work. Happy Crispy, can I just say... Hi, hi to Thumper T. I just have to say, and this is... this You don't get this on channel membership normally, but because we met Crispy when we first started doing the lives in Blackpool, Crispy is the, uh, the only person in the chat that has my WhatsApp number. I trust you'll never put it out, though, Crispy, obviously. So why are you saying it to everybody, then? <laughs> well, I just, I mean, he's, a, he's a very um, valid member. Not that I'd give it to pro members by joining, but... <laughs> yeah, if you want to go I'm up digging a it, hole here. you too can have my number. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't want it, why would you? For an extra 20 pound a month. <laughs> <laughs> give a shout-out to hubby Kevin. Um, his Hi, first time Kevin. watching Kevin, Kevin Power. That's yeah, a good name. Nice one, Kevin. Um, hang on, we've got some Gibraltarians in the house. Uh, Steve says, my Mrs. Kaylee are at home in Gibraltar watching live. Oh, wow. I hope we bump into you whilst you are here. Cheers, Stephen. Thanks for... Do you know what? The last time we did a live, we did actually um, catch up with a few locals. It was quite nice. But you must be very proud to live here. 
Crikey says, um, I'm hotel actually looking at. at flights and hotels in Gibraltar now. You have given me a holiday idea. Oh, just oh. do it. Do it. The weather's lovely. Even if you don't do like a week, just do like a Monday to Friday just to or a it. Friday to Monday. It's really Honestly, I, I was, I, I, when I first came here, when Gabby showed me, I was like, wow. I, was, I kept saying stupid yeah. stuff like, this just feels like it's England, but it's got great weather <laughs> and it's got nice beaches. Although UK does have some nice beaches, obviously, but yeah, it's if you like. But you, it's something you don't come expect. here to think it's just all British because it isn't, obviously. Yeah. But you will still get that Spanish um, vibe. Vibe, obviously, yeah. whether people like get it or little, not. You do. You get a little bit of both. And the only mother care we've ever seen outside of the they UK. They never have a mat That's what I'm talking about. They're everywhere. They're yeah. like ants. Matalan, Matalan, everywhere. But that's the other thing we've just noticed as well. And you'll notice this as we walk up to Marks and Spencers. They might be British shops, but they're really old branding. Like, we don't actually have mother care shops anymore. No. We just have mother they care down. inside of Boots. Oh, oh, really? Well, we have the brand of clothing in Boots. So it don't have like... a pound, Ladley, no. Lisa does have a pound. It's like a, a bit of an outlet hey, in there. somebody said Gabby looking so hot. Not impressed with that. Yeah, I love it. Give me some more. <laughs> Gabby looking hot, unbelievable. Oh, I love it. I don't get that very often, so I'm, I'm nobody ever that. says Thank you. Nobody ever says, Tim, you're looking swish. Oh, if, now you've said or that, handsome. you know everyone's going to tell you you look swish. Now, where is that bakery? I've got that really nice cake from. Peter, no, it hasn't got an Audi or a Tesco. It just has a Morrison's. There is a cake down here. It's past yeah, past it's on the left-hand side, past darling. Past it's on the left-hand side. I'm going to give them a plug because I tell you what, I bought a cake vegan yesterday from there. It was a place called Chop. They need to empty the bins. And that tasted so good. And the girl that was working in there Thanks, made Andrew. it all on Thanks, her own. Joe. Thanks, Joe. Thanks, Josh. Thanks, Jenny. Some people saying Tim looking good today. Yeah, well, you should have seen him earlier <laughs> when he come out of the shower. <laughs> <laughs> no jokes, please. I'm allowed to say that. I've been married to you for 10 years. Certain things you aren't allowed to say yet. 1.3k watching. Wow. It'd be interesting to see what they did on the um, on the um, coronation. Did they have any street parties? Yeah, well, I tell in you Gibraltar? what, they've gone all out with the flags. And I was just saying to Tim, actually, I did actually note this in my vlog because I'm doing a vlog on Gibraltar. Um, that when you were here last doing a live. They'd got bunting up for the Jubilee, I think it was, was it? Oh, yeah, it was. Um, so they had all the flags out then as well. So look, there's a bit of history. Yep. I don't know what that soldier is all about, but that is history right there. But there's also some other history. But then there's that history. This yes. Marks and Spencers has been here in Gibraltar for years, <laughs> but it is the old... No, actually, I would say it's the old branding, but inside it feels old. That might be a slightly newer sign. But it is on. If there's any American viewers watching, you probably have no idea what Marks and Spencers is. Uh, we, there's no S on the end. It's Marks and Spencer, or as we call it, Marks and Sparks. It's basically um, uh, what do they call it? Uh, Gabby, what do you call it? Um, an outlet shop. Uh, what do you call it? Supermarket. No, a shop with loads of designer brands in there. Well, not designer brands, but loads of other companies and <laughs> for goodness sake I forgot it's an outlet store basically most M&S do look old I'm very jealous I've been to Jib many times have you looked at prices the petrol station no I tell you what though the last time we were here we were shot the petrol was brilliant yeah do you know that people really cheap people, people actually come, come over, over from to, Spain yeah, to, to Gibraltar fill right. to and fill buy up. their fags and all that, I mean in this day and age I mean obviously with the cost of living and everything it's crazy oh, but you, really you're going to do it yeah so these properties here, these are not the ocean ones, are they? These are like more of the standard ones. So, how much are we talking for like a standard apartment in Gibraltar? So these are not as 295,000 for that. No thanks. How many bedrooms? Okay. Oh, wow, here, here we studio. are. Only one toilet as well. Oh my god! Oh my god! So that's like our house twice. Three times, Gabby. Oh my god. <laughs> They've got a next here. The next sign is a bit odd as well. And how many nexts do you get with the, uh, the Italian-Spanish influence? Look at that. We do like next. Uh, yeah. I actually haven't been in there. Yeah. Fumpies is enjoying the... He's seen a pigeon. So <laughs> he's, he's seen excited. the pigeon. Shout out to Gabby and Tim, please. Every Sunday and Wednesday, 
you're on our screens. 20th anniversary. What? Samantha. Oh look, an accessorise. Oh, hang on. no, Samantha's saying shout out Gabby and Tim, please. So Samantha wants a shout out. Oh, sorry. Can, can we shout out Nick Blackburn? Every Sunday and Wednesday, you're on our screens. 20th anniversary. So this was special Sometimes shout it's out, Friday. Oh, so you've got a 20th anniversary. Um, Kelvin Farrell, how do you choose who to blur in your videos? What? How do you choose? I only blur, blur people that are very favorite. close in shot, basically, or that like, wouldn't that wouldn't want to be in it. If they're far away, the I don't need to do that. But or, somebody yeah. said, is there a Costa Coffee? There is. Here it is. But to be fair, there's lots of Costa Coffees in Spain anyway. Yeah, there Not are. that we're in Spain. But Tommy Health, Tommy Health, Health figure <laughs> kids <laughs> just there. Do you know what? If you'd have had four wines, it would have been a huge figure. I'm actually Here got... it is. This is where I got my cake. Yeah, let's... From this place called Choc. Darling, I've got a problem. I really need the... Oh, what? You're telling me you need the loo on this live, do you? Are you going to go and check out the toilet? Mm -hmm. the do you think that's a good offer? £25, not euros, to do the official rock tours. By the way, they've got uh, the, the caves here are amazing as well. But look at that. You see them with their little babies. It is so cute, isn't uh, it? Yeah, well, do you know what? I haven't been up the rock since I was a little girl. So. Haven't you? No. <laughs> it sounds wrong, but I maybe, maybe awful, I should take you up the rock tomorrow. Well, I think with my family. Is there a job centre like there? It, no, I don't it. think so. Matt, I can't find a tree. So we have missed a few uh, British shops, but look at this on the left, card factory. Have you they're all closed? Because if well, we obviously actually... it's closed. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say to you is card if factory. we were on Spanish land right now, they'd be open. Because they're open. Ah, right yeah, now. British time. Yeah, British time, five o'clock. Goodbye. Or six o'clock. So, yeah. Gabby, you'll have to keep up with the chat. My, my chat is frozen oh, yeah, right now. Oh, yeah. I apologise. Um, Susie says, been watching tonight on Cyprus. Hotter there. He haven't stopped laughing at you two. <laughs> it's basically well, that's just good. It's bringing a bit of entertainment it's, your it's way. It's basically <laughs> like just walking with a, a marriage counsellor. Like you're our marriage counsellor as we walk down the street. I'm the counsellor. They're the counsellor. No, they you. You guys are the counsellor. Well, do you think they're trying to sort us out today? The courts. Well, be fair, Tim, I think we've done all right. Ten years. This is the courts of we've Gibraltar. Coached. Look at the uh, look how beautiful the building is with all the banana plants. And of course, palm trees. Now this part of Gibraltar and um, Main Street, I really love. You've got the big pillboxes, oh, not pillboxes, but that you would get like in most city streets with the flowers. And you get this really beautiful looking church up here. I don't think the cannons are out. There's normally cannons up here that are gold. I don't think they're the gold, or they're like gold plated or something. So you get a little bit of history here, just in the square, with the cannons, and you get these little emblems that city of Gibraltar. And look, that looks like it would be in the UK, doesn't it? Yes. The, even oh, the uh, the proper British bricks. There are houses that are built like proper British houses. Yeah, as well. that's it is. That's what I mean. And you get some good old British pubs yeah. here. The yeah. Angry Fe Angry Gabby, do you reckon I can get away with going to the toilet? Hey, I do you mind? Know. Do you mind know. holding the fort? Just hold the fort for a second. All right. I, I can do it quicker than you. All right. You just read some of the chat. <laughs> so hi everyone. Tim sneaking in a pub to get the toilet. I would never do that. I couldn't do that. Ah, oh, he's, he's going to get turfed out because he hasn't bought a drink. Tim doesn't realise that when you go into these venues, to use the loo, you need to buy drinks. Tim just walks in. You know what he's like. Anyway, let's do some shout outs while we're here. Sophie, Gabby, your outfit is gorgeous. Can you show us Tim if... Can you show us Tim if she doesn't mind? All right, I'll show you. So. This is an old top, it's from, I don't know if I could do this with the gimbal, I can't, I can't work the gimbal, this is the problem, hang on, damn it, anyway the top's River Islands and I bought it a few years ago and it's um, it's backless and the worst thing is you have to wear like a transparent back bra with it but 
I can't because the bra I had for it from before Casper was born don't fit me anymore because my boobs have changed size. Sorry, too much information, I know, but you did ask. So I'm just wearing a normal flesh coloured one, but it works, it's fine because it's the same as my skin colour, so it's absolutely fine. So there you go, Sophie. And I'm wearing River Island Combats as well. And River Island trainers, I've got the full Monty here. Well, full Monty's naked. No, here he comes. I can see him in the reflection of the bus stop. The proper Gibraltarian hospitality. Normally, if you go into a pub in the UK and you say, can I just go to the toilet? Was that not awkward? It was. He, he basically said, can I help I you? I saw him follow you, and I was like, oh no, he's going to turn me out. <laughs> But he, he was, was like, nice oh, about it. <laughs> I apologise. Um, yeah, give the video a thumbs up. It'd be great to get to a thousand thumbs up Very for the live stream. I can't see. Uh, Kelvin, no, it wasn't a number two, but thanks for that. Love <laughs> River Island kids section. There's no River Island here, now is that there? That would be way too much information. No. I love these plants. What are they called again? Unfortunately, they're a little bit dead though. They're not in colour. Poor little things. Like Somebody will tell me in the chat. I Is forgot what they're called. You obviously only get them in. Um, plant. No parrot plants. Parrot. Yes. Because one has bloomed here. Looks like a parrot. Uh, he's a little bit dead. How do you know it's a he? Somebody said, "Did you have Did a number?" Th Somebody said, "Did you have a number three? What on earth is that?" I think number that's one when you and a number two. Yourself in another way, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know for sure. Gabby, just keep guessing. it clean. This is a family. Oh, it was. It's them lot. This is not. <laughs> it's the family channel. Bird of paradise. Ask, that's the know, bird. You want to be careful what you ask if you want to keep I it know, clean. I know. Honestly. All right. Let's let's talk about the uh, number. Yeah. I just realised that my little boy loves cars as they go past. Oh, there is a shop open. Peak Jim. Someone's having a party up there. Oh, Leanne, we've missed your super chat. When was that, Leanne? How did we not see that? I've been keeping an eye on things like that that have just been popping up. It's probably because my chat's quite slow, darling. It's probably why. Now, look at this twist on a British house. Oh, number three is being sick, apparently. Oh, is it? Well, why would you? You wouldn't go and be sick, could you? Look at this twist on a British house with the Spanish shutters. Isn't that cool? So you can see the rock in every direction, obviously, because Gibraltar surrounds the rock. A lot of people actually got married in Gibraltar, Gabby. Uh, Leanne said, have a cup of tea on me for your anniversary. Oh, Thanks, Leanne. Thank you, Leanne. That's I don't, very, very we need nice. something a little bit stronger than a cup of tea for 10 years of marriage. No, but... no, we don't. <laughs> like, we have had alcohol, but sometimes it is very nice to have yeah, a cup of tea Yeah, you can keep up the chat, well. I'll hold. All right, cool. So we're going to head down to the uh, the water's edge to get a lovely bit of sunset action. If we just walk through Main Street, and we're just going to be walking through this archway, it looks very British with the uh, the phone boxes here on the right hand side. Hi, looking gorgeous, Gabby. Lovely here in Yarmouth. Five hundred eighty-nine thumbs up. Thank you. It doesn't cost you anything to hit that thumbs up, and it helps us out enormously. Shout out to Amy and Alex. Big, we're big fans. Ah. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Amy and We Alex. love your support. Never seen we love that. all your support, actually. I've never seen Everyone's. this before. Am I going crazy? That painted up like that. Be new. What is that? It's it a theatre. It says Hall Theatre. Wow. And a bank. That's the bank. So you go in these gates, and to the left is a theatre, and to the right is a bank. I mean, you couldn't get more mismatched if you tried, could you? <laughs> no. <laughs> but also... Um, you get Gibraltarian money here as well, which is... Yeah, oh my God, tell them about my £10, ten pound in Gibraltarian, whatever. Gib it's not pounds, it's Gibraltarian money. So last time we came to Gibraltar, I went and bought something from Burger King. And do you know what? They gave me £10 Gibraltarian and money back. And you can't back. spend it in the UK. And my dad said to me over and over, make sure they give you it back in euros or English money. Because you can look, spend so English stupid. money here. Yeah, you can. You can use that, or you can have Gibraltarian money, but you can only spend it on the rock. And I got the change in Gibraltarian money, and I was like, I don't need to buy anything else. I've got this money. I thought, I'll save it in my purse for if I ever come back again. Yeah. And we did, and we bought nappies with it. We did. Let's just have a quick look up the rock right now, because you can see 
Um, you can actually drive up or you can walk up, but you can also go on those little lift things that take you up there. But you can, like I say, walk up and go up the steps that I did. That is the most horrendous thing ever because you go to a certain point, you walk up the steep steps and the monkeys are all on the steps and, and you're like paranoid they're gonna get you. British phone box over there, look, standing proud. I love that, doesn't that just look so, just brilliant. Well, we don't even in. have telephone boxes anymore in the UK. That's a good point, why do we still need them? Whoa, look at that old fountain, look at that. I, I think they're trying that. to make the statement that this is British. Okay, so let's have a quick look where we started off. Just there, by the Sunborn Yacht Ocean Village, and we have walked down uh, Main Street, uh, and somehow we're there. But we're just going to walk down to there. But love these old gates, look. I mean, there is so much history in Gibraltar. Not all of it great, obviously. But there is a lot of military still here in Gibraltar. It's still a strategic, 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 I can't say it. Strategic. Position for Great Britain. And as Brits ourselves, I know I apologise if there's Spanish people watching. Let's not start a, a war. But oh, God, sir. <laughs> proud to be walking around Gibraltar but we come on let's be honest we even said it you know I mean like yes other than the the army I mean like it is a bit selfish of us Brits to say no we want it but we've had it for a long time but let, we, know, we don't do. want to go that's into what, that that's what other places do though isn't it oh they, they do in their place and look at Spain that. Spain do it everywhere yeah. yeah there you go Russia's trying to claim Ukraine but we won't go there <laughs> wait I still can't get over these, look. It's Press like you're back button. home. Have you got hold of him? Wait. See, look, it's England, but with palm trees. It's like you're in Bournemouth. <laughs> Bournemouth's got palm trees, so is Devon. Yeah, I love that. Any potholes, like, in the UK? We haven't seen any potholes, no. Shane, um, you are more than welcome. Thank you for your lovely comment. Racing clip, yes, you can do dolphin watching. Obviously, you've got the Straits of Gibraltar. And on a clear day, if we went down to the south part, which is obviously just over there, we can see the lighthouse, and you can actually see Africa from Gibraltar. Wait, there's a... There's no cars coming. There is a oh, okay. bike. Oh, Tim, what would you do without me, honestly? I'm not a super. No, no, congratulations. Oh, well, thank you so much. Look at the shirt. I need that. Quiet. I need I'm that t-shirt. Where yeah. did you get that t-shirt from? You have a fiber ass. <laughs> no, you think you need the t-shirt. You'll you get them online because we do actually know everything. Yeah, well, I don't know. Have you? Have you? Well, just now. No, no, no. This morning. Oh, wow, congratulations. So many people have got married in Gibraltar. It's the place to do it. Oh, you live Nightmare. Yeah. Oh. Got to change all the paperwork. Oh, yeah. So, so you just jumped over. over. Wow. Oh, wow. Well, congratulations to you both. Oh, congratulations. You. And you look beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> and I'm well jealous of your tan. Uh, well, they live yeah, in Spain, so. Shape, but yeah, <laughs> yeah oh, no, you can see it's lovely. Oh, <laughs> look, and just. <laughs> and just like England, look. We've got the old British public. Well, the, what they used to be like. There's still some of these in London, look. The old British toilets. I love the fact that all this is just like moved over. So I'm pointing out toilets here. Does it work? Hey, it does! Woohoo! By the way, that's a leaf, not a number two. <laughs> I just want to say congratulations to John and Leslie who have been married for 13 years. I feel you. I've done 10, so 13. Wow. Respect. Amazing. <laughs> So many married people, uh, so many oh, people have got that. married in Gibraltar. Those people that about, live in Spain it's all as about well. Feeling the love and sharing the love, isn't it? There's a lot of expats obviously love in Spain. Is all around me. And if you need anything <laughs> done, you don't actually have to go back home to England. You can just cross over the, uh, the border to Gibraltar and you can sort out a lot of the stuff. Hence why a lot of expats do that, don't they, Gabby? They do. 1.4k watching. Yes. Hang on, can we yes. just look at the. Uh, yes. This doesn't look British though, I'm sorry to say. What's that about? That's like Spanish. Ow. What's that about? Jib Telecom. That's the oddest phone I've ever seen. Does it work? It does work. Has it got a phone number and see if anyone rings it? Has it got a phone number? How would you find a phone number? Do you remember pay phones used to have the phone number there? and then people would call randomly payphones. 
and it'd be really scary if you walk past a payphone, it would ring. I'm trying to see if there's a number, see if anyone would call it. No, there isn't. That's a shame. Do you remember that, Gabby? Payphones used to have phone numbers. Yeah, do you know what? Sometimes I used to ring, like, reverse the charges. Oh, when those I days. my dad's, like... Those days. <laughs> those days of like, reversing uh, the charges. I can't afford you a do cab. Know. I'm on a night out. If you I do know. the charges, my dad will come and get me, and it used to be, no. like... My dad would be like, well, shush! Doing that. Listen, you do yeah. know they they still do that. Do they? Yeah, I wow. forgot what it is. I forgot what it's called now, but they still do that. You getting in debt with your phone bill? I don't know. Been married six years. Been together fifteen years this year. You know what? I've just Hello, been going through the comments. There are so many people that have been telling us how long they've been married with their partners. I just want to say big up and respect because that is amazing. There's a bus stop. I love it. It's nice to know that people are actually making it and persevering because some people. You know, Give up. they cheat because they're like, there. Eh, Look at me. Uh, this is my second. <laughs> this is my second marriage. Not because I'm difficult, yeah. um, <laughs> but because, um, yeah. Yeah, and this is my second baby. Second baby, first marriage. Second marriage, yeah. first baby. But what we're trying to say is, where are we you, going? You, well, I don't know. You're the ringmaster here. I think we've turned. I think we're supposed to turn right up there. We need to just go up there and right. You're just following that married couple. <laughs> I, they, 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 they confused me, yeah. Well, it was you that said, are you have you just got married today? Well, I just knew she was in a wedding dress. I could tell, and she'd got like a little tiara in her hair. So I just knew. I mean, girls know this thing. Men don't even spot it. A lot of just people... thought I was her um, Saturday night outfit. A lot of people have been day. married um, for well over 20, 30 years. John's 38 years. I think it's amazing. It's so how it should be when you marry someone it's meant to be yeah but darling right. unfortunately I, I it doesn't know, always work like it that it doesn't it doesn't you're here, right? yes, yes <laughs> I your YouTube channel. Oh, but are you Gibraltarian yes. congratulations hey. nice to meet you sir nice to meet how you. are you I'm good Just how long have you been in Gibraltar I've lived here my whole life <gasps> wow were you sense. born here because like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gabby was actually yeah. saying to me yesterday she oh. said do you reckon have you ever been, have you been to the UK yeah oh you have I went to UK all right, I was just, because we was going to say, if, if there's anyone that's actually ever been born in Gibraltar and never left, do you know of anyone? Yes, quite a few people. Really? Oh my God, yeah, because we said that the other day. I said, I wonder if, if there are some people that have been born on the rock and have just stayed on the rock. Yeah. And you what know, they must think if I they was to ever go to the actual UK. Like never left, so yeah. I wondered if it was the same. With it being small, I thought, it's unlikely, but I wonder. Yeah, it's the same. Wow, amazing. Can I ask you a question, though? Yes. You could be honest. Would you... Moved to the UK. I was there for permanently. Uh, eight years for you. Did you miss Gibraltar? Yes. Uh, what was the thing you missed? Now that I'm here, I miss UK as well. Oh, do you? Uh, What's the thing you miss about Gibraltar when you were in the UK? Everything's so small. I know anyone. Yeah. Do people? Uh, does everyone know everyone? Yeah. Do they? Does everyone I know each other's business? Like ten, ten times on the way this way. Yeah. Ah, but that, best oh, that, yeah. that can be great, but it also can be awkward, I guess. It's worse when you're a teenager. Oh, when you get into yeah. trouble. Yeah. <laughs> everyone knows you've been naughty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, is it cheap to live in Gibraltar compared to the UK? Uh, some, some ways, yeah, some ways, no. Because somebody... not, is it? No. No, so it's really expensive. People, like, a lot of the expats from the UK that live in Spain, they cross, cross over. Oh. So here's a question as well. Do you like him? Obviously, bumps? while we've been here, yeah. obviously, with it being British... I feel like this is turning into an interview. Would, I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I've got to ask these questions. <laughs> But a lot of I'm people sure. like um, you think are going to speak British, yeah. but then you go to the other side of the rock or other places yeah. on the rock. It's more Spanish than you think. And they don't understand you at all. The accents I have, so my accent isn't a Gibraltarian accent, but a lot of them um, coach switch a lot. So right. we go from English to Spanish, and some words are Spanish, some words are English. Wow. So you've just got to sort of know how it turns. Yeah. Wow. Or if. It comes naturally, like with my mum, it's supernatural. We just do it backwards yeah. and forwards, but it can be any word. So like there's wow. some words so it's a that mush up. I know in Spanish, I didn't know in English. Some words I know in English, that I don't know in Spanish. That's insane, isn't it? Yeah. It's really peculiar. Yeah. But well, it was it's nice good. to be. We, li I literally came here for the first time when I first met Gabby about. 10 years ago and I fell in love with it I was like wow because yeah. there's a TV well, you, you get English yeah. TV here but on Channel 5 they've done this whole Britain in the Sun yeah, yeah, yeah. and I think a lot of people don't realise just what's here what it's like here they've heard of it but don't think about it they just don't really think about it until you know because it is so far away from yeah. the UK they don't realise where it is yeah. and then they go oh that's too far yeah, and, then, yeah. and then they go but that can't really be like that can it Yeah. and I'm like yeah it is Amazing. it really is 
So would you say, final question, I won't ask you anymore, <laughs> I promise. <laughs> um, do you think you'll stay here forever? I don't know. Where do you plan to go? Do you plan to go to the UK? I have no plans. It's just kind of... If it, go with the flow. If I got a job in the UK, I'd go to the UK. If I stay here, i stay here. But you wouldn't want to go into Spain? Uh, I'd go to Madrid if I got a job in Madrid. Yeah. It doesn't make a difference to me. But Spain or England? England. There you go. Well, hey. Wow. <laughs> You've got to. Or Gibraltar, yeah. Oh, that's amazing to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. What was your dog's name? Indy. Indy. Hello, Indy. Hey. Oh, hey, oh, hey, oh. oh. I think Thumbs would like Indy, look. <laughs> Hello, He's never Indy. seen a dog before, actually. Well, he has. Well, not properly. Well, not not really close up. No. <laughs> nice to meet. What was your so name? Joel. Joel. Thanks you for coming, Sarah. We're going in that direction, don't you? No, we've got to go that direction, just right down towards the harbour. Are we? We're going to the harbour. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you, Joel. Bye, Indy. Aww. Isn't that lovely? Uh, the local time is half past nine. I interrogated that guy. I feel absolutely terrible. You should be uh, an interviewer. I know. Although I did help uh, you out. I missed the trick here. I should not be a singer. Shout me out <laughs> my partner when you guys post. Love you guys post. Ellen, Ellie. <laughs> Poor guy only wanted to take his dog. He, knew, oh, he no. wanted to talk to us. He no, he to said ask me anything you want, didn't he? Yeah, he so open. we did. So I did, and I just totally blitzed it. <laughs> That's an old hotel, Queen's Hotel. Where's the Rock Hotel? That's where Dad used That's, to stay. Uh, that is where actually is that? further up there. Oh, is it? But you can still see the military pass from Gibraltar hotel. as well. In fact, the last time I was here, I didn't see this. This mural, 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 mural. It's mural, been painted mural, mural? about Gibraltar's past. We need to go back to school, really. <laughs> Swilk says, give us a song. Uh, I can't, I'm off duty. I'm on duty, but not. I'm not singing duty. Look at <laughs> that, though. Look at that depicting the, uh, the war. Many wars that have, uh, you know, to claim That's Gibraltar. That's Spanish Armada. You learned that in school then? I did, and you know how I learned about the Spanish Armada? By not learning about it. The teacher made me stand up and totally crucified me in the classroom because I zoned out every time they talked about it. Yeah. And um, I was so embarrassed by it, I never forgot then what the Spanish Armada was. She was Gabby. <laughs> <laughs> um, it does feel like you're walking around an army barracks in parts, yeah, but I can't like it it's, it's obviously the past obviously that's what Gibraltar was all about we're at uh, Ragstaff Road right now you can go through the gates it was heavy heavily militarized back in the day I think this is the right way to go might be getting confused here I'm sure it is down towards the harbour yeah it is some nice houses up here we'll get to see a very nice sunset towards Africa we might see the Horn of Africa is that the right Horn of Africa no, what's it called Casablanca, no, where is it? What we see across Morocco? No, what do you see from um, Gibraltar? You see Africa. It what's is the... Africa. No, I don't... but what's it called? You mean the actual place? I don't know. Um, oh. I thought Morocco was just over there. I'll just. No. How's it? Wow! You actually know some geography, Gabby. I'm surprised. Don't you be like my geography teacher? <laughs> Start putting me down, mister. Tangiers, that's it. Thank you very much. I know a lot of geography. I've been on a lot of planes. I've been absolutely terrified. And because I've been on a lot of planes, it's made me drink a lot uh, of wine That's where well. we're heading, yeah. Sunset here is really lovely. And Gabby, honestly, I found all this out when I did a live. The very first live I did in Gibraltar, I walked down here and I was like, wow, this is really lovely. Yes, I know, because this is where you went into the casino, wasn't it? And, no, uh, no, no. I think there's a casino in here. You, well, you had a wine here then or something happened No, I didn't. Here. Here, no, it know? didn't. That was ocean. That was ocean view, darling. I'm sure you was going to have a drink or something here, Tim, because I remember thinking to myself, "Git." I love. <laughs> <laughs> I love the smell of the water. Very Mediterranean like here. This. This really nice. does feel very, very Mediterranean. Look at the sunset. Now, Gabby, you're going to have to just. Oh, uh, lovely yeah, we'll walk down there in a second. Let's just have a quick look at Morocco. Uh, not here. Morocco, um, Africa. Can you just quickly just help me up? Do you wanna... Why don't you go down there? I'll wait here with fun. That's probably a better you idea. Back, you? Yeah, I'll quickly show you. Gorgeous sunset. Well, now how much is to hire a boat from here? And I, I, I guess there are rules. You can't just sail over to Africa, can you? You can lose connection, Gabby. You know that. Okay, I'll reconnect you again. All right. Wow. 
four million pounds semi-detached houses over there yeah they can be quite expensive uh, is the Sunborn yacht still moored in the harbour? Of course it is. I'm actually staying in there at the moment. There's a video coming on that very soon. Um, stop and take a picture of Gabby with that background. I know, beautiful view. This phone actually does really show sunsets off really nicely. The colours. I hope you can see the colours. It depends if you're watching on TV, I don't know. <coughs> I've never seen anyone in these apartments. Eating healthy, evening. Uh, how many thumbs up have we got? 1,422 people watching the sunset here in Gibraltar. Honestly, I can't stress enough. If you've never been and you, and you think about wanting to get a cheap getaway, the flights are so cheap on EasyJet. They really are. Obviously, you have to fly, fly from Gatwick, but the flights are so cheap. Come and discover, you know, a piece of Britain in the sun and you'll be hooked you will want to come back and you can get a bike that's the best thing to do you'll see like I say after you've watched the live um, in the description I've got the link to the full video tour of Gibraltar that I did go and watch it get some ideas and as we look at the uh, sunset over towards Spain And I love that sound, I don't know if you can hear it on the camera. When you're by the water and you can hear ships in the distance. I'm lucky enough to live by the sea and I hear that often when I'm at home in the house. It's like a, a slow kind of hum noise that you can hear when ships are going past. There's the fish that live in the water here. But look at this. What a beautiful sunset. Look at the water. That is amazing. It's a shame Gabby couldn't see this, unless she's watching the live right now. There is always a lot of oil tankers around Gibraltar, but try not looking at that and just look up to the rock. This side, the rock doesn't look that big, does it? But when you look the other side, it's a lot more of a, a rock face. Just very quickly, I said earlier in the video that you can walk up some steps Believe it or not, those are steps. They are the steepest steps. And there's monkeys all the way up there, by the way. But the steepest steps in Gibraltar, if you did want to do some power walking, it will literally kill your legs. Look at that though, beautiful. Could remind me of the French Riviera, the, uh, the Amalfi Coast in Italy, or somewhere in Spain. But here in Gibraltar, looking lovely. Um, it's not really Blackpool in the sun, no. That's Benidorm, what some people say. Um, was there in March from Manchester, £50 return. See, cheap. Shiggy King, hello to you. How many steps in there? I have no idea, a lot. See, Gabby's going to want to stop to go for a drink. I know she will. Half past nine here in Gibraltar. We're an hour ahead, still Spanish time. Which you would actually think that, you know, saying, well, it doesn't matter, even if we, Gibraltar, Gibraltar was saying that it's British, but it's still got to be on Spanish time because of where it is in the, in the world. It'd be a bit weird if you literally crossed the line going from Spain to Gibraltar and they changed time code. <laughs> that would be so weird. But you'd almost think, well, they should, shouldn't they? If they're gonna keep British, keep British time. A lot of expensive yachts. <clears throat> Leanne Spampamato, if you've been watching, Leanne, I thought you were a regular channel member. And watcher, yes, I've been to do, uh, to Benidorm loads of times. I was there last year, we did a live. I'll be doing a live in Benidorm soon. There's a couple of videos on my channel about Benidorm if you haven't watched them already. Uh, Gabby has been to Benidorm with me as well, yeah. Uh, Bobby says, I saw Hayes travel, it's 1,200 for a week in Gibraltar. Where on earth are you looking? Remember, book your flights, they're cheap, and then do hotels.com or Trivago. We stayed in the Holiday Express, which is about 58 quid. Now you bear that in mind with a flight to 50 quid. 
So it's pretty good value for money. Somebody said take your photo with that view. It is beautiful, isn't it? Photo um, opportunity. So um, screenshot, you mean? Yeah, put it on Facebook. Tim there you the go. Background. No, you don't want me in the background. I'll just ruin it. By reconnected. Do you invest at all in what? Do Alicante. <coughs> oh dear, Papa. Oh dear. Thumbs does this weird thing that every time he coughs, he sneezes. He's you sneeze, don't you? You go, etchu, etch, etchu. Put your cardigan on. Let me just quickly pop his cardigan on. Sorry about It really the isn't cold, darling. Yeah, but his arms are a little bit chilly. But we're walking, so that's fine. Amber says, handsome. You talk about me, Amber? So there are a few restaurants. What we're going to do is we're going to walk back down Ocean Village this way. Yeah, but on. honestly, we, we haven't walked yeah, around yeah. the whole of the rock. As you can see, we've only walked around half of it. It continues around there, around the lighthouse and around on, the I've other end. I've got to reconnect to you. Give me one sec. Sorry. What have you been doing? Well, Hopefully, I'm chatting to men. That's for me tonight. We need to find out. What does that mean? <laughs> to know, it just sounded really mysterious. You don't say that to your husband, darling, unless you want to go to marriage counselling. <laughs> marriage counselling that's why we do the lives malta john yes um so i will tell you about some of the um there's obviously loads of the british seaside and more hotel reviews worst rated stuff coming up but uh, trips abroad wise coming up in the next couple of weeks uh, greece and um egypt well not really egypt shall i shake not really Egypt, but no. oh, if I was to put I visit nice. Egypt, they'd say it's not Egypt, but you know what I mean. Yeah. I won't be doing a live from there, I don't think. Yeah. These are always so busy, aren't they? Yeah. We don't want to interrupt people's meals, but yeah, lovely place for sunset meals. As your uh, auntie would say, sundowners. But they start sundowners very early. Yeah. But sundowners should be like from when the sun sets, right? Yeah. <laughs> it is a place for uh, certain gambling, yes. Gibraltar, you always see that. If, you, if you've ever gone on any of those online gambling sites, they always see something at the bottom saying Gibraltar. Is it a tax haven here? I always get confused. Tax haven? Yeah. Do you pay tax in Gibraltar or something like that? Someone will tell me in the chat, it's something like that with businesses. I'm not sure. Gavin, yes, I've made that mistake when I first ever went to Egypt. If you see my video that's coming up, literally, the reps will tell you that they'll bring the whole family down and they'll try and get you to buy stuff and they'll lock the doors. They really do. In fact, I'll see if I can get it live on a, um, not live, but I'll see if I can get it on the video. Look at that camera ring, that's nice. Oh my God. Gabby would never do boats. Oh, this is a shame. I... Even if it was a really nice sun seeker, you wouldn't do boats, would you? Well, is it brighter there than Malaga lovely, right now? I'm not too bossed back, bossed, bothered no, about Malaga would be darker, one. just a little bit darker. Um, okay, yeah, Gibraltar is a small British overseas territory and is known as a tax haven due to its tax benefits of non resident companies. There you go. Sarah Ricketts wants to know if we're off to a bar. Well, we might be, we'll end at a bar, yeah, and Gabby will have a I'll have a cheeky vino. That's what the Spanish call a wine. One always leads to another. Yeah. We're here for work, and then darling, remember. Leads to another. You're not here on holiday. No. <laughs> hey, it is my anniversary. Anniversary. The anniversary. It is. How many thumbs up? Thumbs up from got? Lewis and Lisa. Thanks, Lewis and Lisa. Did he really do a takeaway from Egypt? Happy anniversary from Karen and John from Libsen, uh, Lips, Lipsburn in Northern Ireland. We are married 45 years this Saturday. Wow, amazing. Uh, oh, we need to go this way. Oh, right, okay. I do remember where we're going. There's a nice park up here, actually. It's getting dark quick, though, isn't it? Yes. Remember, we're an hour ahead, if you're wanting to know. Only 758 thumbs up. We've got nearly 14,000, uh, 14,000, 1,400 people watching. Giving the video a thumbs up would help it out. Just pushes it out to uh, more of my subscribers to say you're enjoying the video. Wait, there's a door there. Liz says wine Just... is a work expense and I'm sorry, Tim, but I have to agree with Liz. She is absolutely <laughs> bang on the nose with that one. 
I've never noticed that. Can you go in there? Is that like a, what's in there? Oh look, we can actually see British ambulance. You, although that looked a bit Spanish. Um, you do get British policemen here as well, wearing full British regalia. That must be so hot. We need to cross over, darling. Well, there was a cross in there. We could have crossed that. Come on in. Well, we might as well just wait for the road to clear now. Because <laughs> it's not many cars. Good job we're not in America, otherwise we'd be jaywalking. Yeah. But we're in a British place. Let's go. That's one thing. When I took Gabby to America, she didn't know anything about it. She went, what's wrong? I went, you can't do that. You, feel, you could get arrested and get fined. She went, what? For crossing the road? I went, yeah. Yeah, you've got to abide by... But you've got to remember, the, the reason why they the do airport. that, they do that because of um, the amount of accidents that happen when people cross the roads in America. So that's the reason why they do it. See, that's weird, isn't it? Behind those walls is... Um, where we were just walking. So we're sort of coming back around. Yeah. Do they drive on the same side of the road? They, yes they do. They drive on the left. Somebody said they didn't, they do, they drive on the left. Apparently in Gibraltar. there's a few restaurants in that tunnel. Oh, is there? Wow. Life on the ocean wave, uh, no plans at the minute, but, um, well, you know, Blackpool and me, can't be away too long. No. Second home. Well, I won't go that far. After Sandbanks. <laughs> <laughs> After Gibraltar. <laughs> and America. Newport Beach. But the local football club has a, uh, a little club here. The Lions Football Club. That's cool. Which is kind of in the walls of um, Wellington Front. Which date, dates back to 1850. Amazing. And it's all in the walls there. Look at that. Just going there for a drink. Lions Gibraltar Football Club. Yeah, but do you have to be a member to get a drink in there? Maybe. That is cool. I have noticed there are more and more. No, sorry, they're buildings. driving. No, they're driving on the. Um, they are driving on the right, not the left. My mistake. Yeah, that is right. So that part is Spanish. Does the runway Gibraltar Airport still have the road running through it? Yes, it has to. That's um, otherwise people wouldn't be able to get onto the rock. Tyler wants to know when you're back in Eastbourne, Tim. Oh, I'm going there soon actually to check out a very nice hotel. I love oh, this what park a though. Park. Yeah, I this is really it. feng shui. This yet. is uh, this is called Commonwealth Park. This is really wow. nice. Love this. It's lovely to have a walk around and you feel safe as well because look at the CCTV cameras there. So yeah. you know, and it's all lit up. And there's a nice little nice. pond there. There's, there's that, that pond that has grass, got- grass, it's like seriously green for abroad in, I know this is a British <laughs> island, but- Didn't it smell nice? Really, that must be well watered. It smells like summer. Yeah, it does smell nice. It's the palms. What a nice place to come and chill. It's compared to St. George's Park in Great Yarmouth. I don't know how well you uh, can see this. Compared to St George's Park in Great Yarmouth, it's I not know, really the exactly same. Yarmouth. I can relate it to. Um, it's it's actually same. almost like a piece of uh, home, a piece of oh, Britain, nice. but here on the uh, southernmost tip of, of Spain. No, it's a bridge, Gabby. No, up there. Oh, the right. Hang on, listen that to that. Is a I'm on it. Can you hear that? What's that? Is that a frog? Trust Gabby to find a stage. Do you know, I've never heard a frog like that before. It's a pretty cool bandstand, actually. I don't remember, I think they were doing this up the last time I was here, because I don't remember seeing that. Can you say hi to my boyfriend, Brad? He's a massive fan of Tim's videos, thanks. Oh, hi, Brad. Hi, Brad. Crickets, no, it's not crickets. By the way, if you, if you wanted to get to Gibraltar today, the airport has been closed because of a strike. It's lucky that we didn't have a flight out today, but yeah, yeah it's closed Actually, because of a strike. Actually, there are crickets. 
Now that's not a cricket well. though. No, but there is crickets as well. Warren oh, is Clark, it? congratulations on your anniversary. Lynn and I celebrate 49 years tomorrow wow. on the 11th. Oh my God, amazing. A lot of people get married in May, don't they? Wow, congratulations to you guys. I'm a lot of people get married in the summer, darling. Oh, yeah, but May seems to be really popular uh, for it. Thumps. Uh, uh, <laughs> Leanne says, I've been to Gibraltar before, but I'm going back to Barcelona for a few days. Do you know what? I actually tried to get a room in the W in Barcelona, which is an amazing hotel on the, uh, on the seafront. And the price for some of those rooms are ridiculous. We're talking 3,000, 4,000, 6,000 pounds for a room. I thought the Burj Al Arab was expensive in Where Dubai, uh, the W in Gibraltar, uh, <laughs> the w, w in Barcelona. I was going to say, it's a really, you can get that. some amazing rooms, but the prices are just stupid. They're just stupid. Why would you spend £5,000? I know I spent 1500 quid, but I mean, that was a once in a lifetime thing. Why would you spend £5,000 on a room? Oh, look at the flower. It's, it's in full bloom there. Look at that. When are you coming to New York? Pardon? When are you coming to New York, someone said. December? Are you? <laughs> no, I'm not. You can go where you want, I don't mind. <laughs> it's cheaper if I don't go without you, darling. Well, it's a nice bit of peace for me and all. Rude. <laughs> Show me something British, please. John, if you've been watching the stream from the beginning, you will see there's been plenty of British stuff that we've showed you. Excuse me. <laughs> wow, Gabby, what's that smell? No. What's that smell? It smells like mint. Goodness sake, can you, honestly, I wish you could have smell of vision now. I don't know what it is, it smells like, uh, I don't know. It's flowers. Yeah, I know, sure. but this, it's, it's a really, it's a really it's lovely really smell. But anyway, perfume, this is really lovely. Somebody said, show me something British. All right, we'll show you the British toilets that are still nice around in London. Oh, wow, tip me What? You can still see the gun mounts up there, actually. There's a leisure centre in here. Sorry, it's a little bit dark. I don't know where Gabby's taking me now. She's gone. King's Bastion Leisure Centre. Wow, I think it's got bowling in it. You know, we'll definitely lose signal in there because yeah. uh, it's in the, it's in the right. rock. It's kind of like Just quickly. It's a little bit like Is this all in the rock? Hang on. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's cool. That's amazing. That's all in these um, the town walls. What are your plans on Sunday? Uh, Sunday? Oh, uh, we won't be doing a live on Sunday, but there will be a video. You can see the video of where we're staying um, tomorrow, which is the Sunborn um, in Gibraltar, which is a really nice oh, five-star hotel. It's not a secret anymore. Well, not for tonight, but tomorrow. Cat is out the bag. See, now you could be in London, look. Right by the toilet. You could be in Hyde Park right now, couldn't you? you? Well, sort of. Kind of. Maybe. Hi to the Bard for joining us. Signal is. Do you know what, John? Sometimes the signal in Gibraltar is always better than actually in the UK. Hopefully, the picture quality should be good. This is a live stream, of course, if you're watching this back on replay. Hence oh, why there's no editing. Craig, just got your um, super chat. I just had news my auntie passed away raise a glass to her um we will raise a glass in just a moment craig thank you um for informing us and thank you for your super chat obviously and i'm sorry to hear that sorry to hear that craig um john um yes definitely sunborn london was amazing simon it was all right the sunborn in gibraltar is a lot better though i'm not gonna lie maybe it's because it's somewhere really 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 nice I'm actually shocked, Gabby, because normally when we do a live, I lose you to go... To the toilet? Yeah. And yet it was you that went to the toilet. Yeah. You know why that was? And how are you faring at the minute? I feel fine. And do you know why I feel fine? Because I've had two glasses of wine and that hydrates you. Dehydrates you. Which means you don't need to go for a wee. So it's not positive, but it is when it comes to this walk. Unfortunately for you, it made you go in the opposite direction. Wow. Whew, breathe. All I remember is the stairs up here can be a little bit of a pain. See, this has all been changed since I was last here with all these lights, you know. 
Wow, this is so nice. I have not seen this side of things. This is um, really nice. Champion Park. So obviously this is the other side of the leisure centre, is it? So that's all inside there? Oh, wow. Amazing. Yeah, no, they were doing building work here. The only problem is, is I don't think there's a lift up. We, there's, there's stairs, which we need to go up there, Gabby, but there's stairs, so um, I don't know what we're going to do. Can't we go this way? We'll go around that way? Well, I still think there's stairs. Yeah, but this is all, um, Why? Well, I say reasonably way, new, but it does look really nice, doesn't it? Yeah, you can tell it's new, though, because it looks so... The lights are Green. quite fancy, aren't they? And the grass looks ultra fresh, like it hasn't been laid long. And do you know what? Normally in Spain, like, you oh, get the, the grass, know. which is really thick. A bit muddy at ours. Because um, the hard wearing grass, but it's quite very light here. Um, turn left. Uh, Kieran. There, no. Apparently. Oh, is there? Left. Turn left. Where? We'll go this way. There's a Yoroski here as well. Oh, maybe the lift is down his way. <clears throat> this is all new, right? Yeah. Wow, they're really developing here. Yeah, we were just saying in, in the Gabby said the years you know that she's been coming to Gibraltar, how much it's changed, and even in just a few years that I've been coming here, like um, Caletta Bay, you know, I stayed in the hotel there that was there for sixty years that's been demolished, and I don't know Lips. whether. Are these? Are these? Yeah, but how can you? I don't know. Yeah, but that's that's the Burlington, darling. I don't think you want to go there. No. Unless you can walk through there. Any Gibraltarians, please help us out. <laughs> Normally we have to go up the stairs. Why would we follow the geezer? He probably is not going where we were going, Abby. Well, we were following him for quite a while. Uh, okay, so we're, we're a little bit lost. <laughs> no, we'll just keep going up here and see where we, where we go. Can you ask in the pub? Eugene, there's no pub. Well, there's any pubs in here. They've got a what? Coffee shop. Well, they've got it all the Join us as we get lost for the first time ever in Gibraltar. That's right, we can go out this way. There's a road, we'll be fine. We do need to go kind of up there, but I think, well, I hope we can. Fumps is still awake. He's enjoying this trip. He loves being out in the farm, don't he? And it's a very, very warm Look evening. Look at the sofa, Bubs. You're having a good time. He's loving it. All, we can, all I can see is his little feet that bless his little heart. Who knows? Uh, he has got um, sandals, but he won't keep them on for love nor money. Uh, go up the stairs, that's the development. Stephen says you go back to the leisure centre. I bet you, oh no, 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 I think we are going completely wrong here. Hang on, where are these cars going? Well, I don't know, I should get them out somewhere. Yeah, no, but I'm sure I went along here and you can't get up because of the uh, this huge wall going here. Go back to the leisure centre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, darling, yeah, we're out. In roughly the right direction. Roughly. Don't trust certain people, they might tell us to go in the wrong direction. Eugene says, I'm going to check Google Maps. <laughs> no, I think we can go that way, darling, because you can see Ocean View just over there, so we can keep going. Let's just, let's just risk it for a biscuit, shall we? Let's hope so, anyway. Should we get on the path, though? Well, this isn't the main road, so we're okay. Yeah, I know. We apologise about the break in transmission. Gabby's took us the wrong way. This is the thing about really married. Me? This is the thing about married life. You should always blame the. Fault. You always blame the other half. No, you always blame me for everything. You do and too. And I just take it on the chin. The kind of stuff Tim only shows us on a live, yeah. Apparently, carry this on would be, down. This would be edited out. If I was doing a video, I'd be editing this out. This be but during a live, we've actually got quite a few bloopers to show at Christmas. Tim, we still need to get on the path. 
There's no cars coming. Yes, I know, but let's just do it. There's a lot of white vans in there. Let's be sensible about this. We've got 1.3k watching. Let's show good, you know. Etiquette. Et yes, sort of. Sort For of. thumps. I wouldn't call it etiquette, but yeah, sort of. It's nine, oh, it's almost 10 o'clock here, you know. Wow. God, that's the problem with Gibraltar. They stop serving food really early and we want to eat. Well, we can always do room service if we oh, have yeah, to. I, say do it I don't really want to do room service. because Apparently, it's Jenna says we've got 901 likes. Can, can we, we get, get to, to a thousand? thousand? That would be awesome. I could have said jinx then, but I didn't. Yeah, oh, I just didn't. Then you never would have talked for the rest of my life. I would have but there's still, then Gabby, there's jinx, still steps up go. there we need to go, right? Yeah, but you can go around. Can you? Yes. I see light at the end of the tunnel. Why does it go up to go back down? There are people that like to walk. <laughs> yeah, that's the reason why it's been done. That's what I do like though. Our, our viewers are from all over the world. No matter where I am in the world, I'm doing a live. Someone can always point me in the right direction. Amazing. Amber says 1.3 watching. Oh yeah, that we go amazing. here and we go right. That's right. We can go up them stairs, but obviously with a pram, no way. Well, it's health and safety. That's what I wanted to um, represent. Good health and safety. There you go, British bin. Someone wanted to see something British. Oh dear, someone's swearing. Live stream. Family channel. Go to the left and you'll find You mean the right? We can't go left. We're going right. We're going left. That's what I'm saying. Oh I see, right, yeah. Are you are you still here? Am I still here? Yeah, just checking. I just think it was gonna go to toilet. Life of Jazz, thank you. What the Yeah, Life of Jazz, thanks for joining channel life membership. Right We've been getting Rain Island, good stream guys. Thank you so much, Life of Jazz, that is so kind of you. If you are new to the live stream, okay, you might be confused about what the heck it is. But uh, nine times out of 10, Gabby is with me. The 1% of the time I'm on my own, but we will um, we'll do a live stream around different locations, have a chat, yeah. um, and talk about the areas Chew we're the going fat. to. A what? Chew the fat. Oh. I was trying to get down with the kids then with the lingo oh I remember walking through here before with a case to get to the airport I know where I'm going I apologize about the break in transmission this isn't the nicest part of Gibraltar we're not really showcasing it here we should have walked back but because we've got the pram we couldn't really walk up them stairs any words of wisdom from Gabby really <laughs> So does that mean we're not going to get any food? Oh, of course, yeah, because I remember when I did, um, I was up the rock and I came down quite late because I watched the sunset. And I came back down at around about half past 10 and they were stopped serving food. So you are right. There's a pub there. Pub there, Gabby. like it. No dogs allowed though. Chris says, um, this is the kind of thing you don't get from other YouTubers, live, you getting lost. He said he loves it. <laughs> you love us getting lost. Well, I think he likes the fact that you're my Yes, we appreciate that it's not everyone's cup of tea, but um, if you do love a little bit of banter and, uh, and sitting at home and being whisked somewhere else, I, I do watch a lot of live other streamers as well. I, there's something about it I kind of like. I kind of like it, as sad as it sounds. Gabby was like, what are you watching? I'll be in bed all snuggled up and watch someone else do, doing a live stream somewhere randomly elsewhere in the world. I kind of like it because I'm safe in my bed and they're doing the walking. That sounds bad, doesn't it? No, I understand because it feels like you're doing it without having to... Do it. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. And sometimes if you're like me and you feel like you just want that, uh, that getaway... You want it to be somewhere else. It's just nice to almost experience it yourself without having to do it or pay the money. But then it gives you the urge to do it. It's like, do you remember when we watched the Inbetweeners movie? How many people watch the Inbetweeners movie, if you've seen that film, and coming out of the cinema, they say, I want to go on holiday now. People often say that yeah. to me. There are certain films you watch, like Sex and the City 2. Oh I yeah, I want to go to Abu Dhabi. Like, yeah, it does. Dubai, it it or, makes you want to yeah. go to Abu Dhabi in Dubai. The amount of people that have come up to me, and it's very kind of you, when you say, uh, we're here, like we, the last time we was in Gibraltar, somebody said, we're here because of you. Ocean Village, I can see a sign. There it is. 
God, because my legs are killing me. Woo! How many calories do you reckon we burnt just then, Tim? So yeah, we're sorry about that. It was a bit random. Still see up the rock there, look at the lights. Get a cheese Doritos burger. I really want to, but Gabby won't let me. Well, I will let you, but it's just that that's really like teasing. I don't mind you getting Jack's, one, but please don't Jack Flash it Poet. Face. Get on the I pavement. Could, I, could, uh, I could watch this all night. Really? Yeah. Appreciate that. Crikey says, not a holiday if you don't get lost. Well, that's true. Yeah. To be fair, we're always lost. I'm just like no, a no, lost no, soul no. in general. No, 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 no. Let's get it right. What we do <laughs> is. Just around like a lost soul. What I do is, I say we need to go this way, and Gabby like, will always no, go. We need to go this way. No, Gabby will go. Echo. <laughs> Gabby will always go. No, no, no. I, th I think it's this way. And I said, well, how do you know? You go, because I think it is. That's not maps. You're not Google Maps. I follow my nose with coffee. And you and nine times out of ten you're wrong. Oh look, Actually, we can see you're the... just saying that you know I'm right, but you don't want to tell everybody that because you're worried about being like the one that doesn't know as much. Uh, but I am right. I'm always right. You can see the rock lit up just on the we're on the uh, the oh, west little facing. Little oh yeah, you can. Nice. Honestly, when the um, when the mist and the fog. Um, which happens a lot, goes up the uh, the eastern side of the the rock face. It makes it so eerie sometimes because the mist and the fog rolls in, and it always hangs around the rock. And from up from down here, the rock doesn't actually look that high. It's until you go up there, and you realise how high it is. I can't believe Funks has stayed awake the whole time. Can you? Yeah, I know. We'll have another sleep this night. <laughs> Um, John says that he's the walker in his family, his missus isn't. Do you know what? I'm not the walker either. I just, I'm not. Like You've I, done I a good do job this, tonight, Dan, and well done. But honestly, I'd much rather just get in the car. The other night, I had a gig so close to my house, and I could have just walked. It was a stone throw away, and I still got in the car. There is uh, a couple of casinos here. I would love to say that me and Gabby are going to go out, go and have a good old drink Rip and go roaring. and hit the casinos, but... We've got a, um, a little boy here, look at his little feet, <laughs> who literally <laughs> likes to keep us up every hour of the night. And this is no exaggeration, but last night, whether you want to know this or not, but we'll this tell you. no exaggeration. He woke us up every hour, then every half hour, mm -hmm. then every half hour, uh -huh. half hour. Mm -hmm. He's laughing, can you hear him? Are you laughing for? Did you keep us awake all night? Did you keep us awake all night? Yeah, you did. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, well, literally we have we've like no sleep at all. And Robert De Niro's just had a baby as well. Congratulations! Or is he What's pregnant? What's that got to do with our sleepless nights? Well, he's uh, set, how old is he? Eighty odd. He's got some serious sleepless nights. Cause he won't be able to get back to sleep. How will he do it? Don't know. Oh well, he's got so much money he'll get a nanny. So if you're thinking of having a baby at that age, there's hope for you yet. So obviously we started off here and we're going to end up here and have a drink. Where should we go? Do you want to go by this Sunborn itself? Oh, I tell you what, Tim. I really fancy Irish a bar. really nice cocktail. Obviously can't have pina colada. I'm definitely not having a mojito. Oh, actually, there is... And, um, um, and then I want some food. There is a nice... Um, Where does it smell good? Here it smells good. Very tapas. It, well, it smells good. You, you decide. I went there. American... Should we go there? Because I went here for um, a drink once before. Did you like it? Yeah, it was nice. I showed everyone my credit card. Oh, well, that's very nice for other people. <laughs> like an idiot. But we can sit out here and have a drink at the yeah. uh, American Grill at the Ivy. Nice. And um, we'll see if we can get a table looking out the water. Yeah, we should be able to. It's very warm still. It's about, it's about 20... Four degrees, I think. It was 23, about 24 degrees now. There's music, but if we keep going down the end, we might be okay. It's fine there. It's gonna be too much music here though, Gabby, that's the thing. But it's quite nice. I remember being here at sunset, right by the water, and also right by 
that uh, floating hotel, the Sunborn five star hotel. You'll be able to see the video from there on Sunday. Should we see it around here? Dad, 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 and Monkey, that's in the Who? chat. Dad, a monkey, I think that's the name, has said he's going on a Norwegian cruise. Do you ever plan on going on one? On Norwegian cruise? I am planning to do a cruise, um, but I don't know. <sighs> I don't know where to start, to be honest, but yes, I did want to do a Royal Caribbean cruise, but we haven't, um, I haven't planned anything just yet. But yes, we'll just get a very quick drink and we'll just um, say thank you to you uh, for staying with us tonight, getting lost in Gibraltar, which wasn't really the plan, but I knew that probably would happen. It has been fun though. Yeah, we love Gibraltar. As I said, you know. Um, Never a dull moment really, is there? As I said, as the casino is behind us, if you've um, oh, what are you this way. have to drink, baby. By the way, the baby is still with Just us. Just pull my chair towards you. <laughs> yes, honestly. Get over here, Gary. If you love travelling, you want to go somewhere Boozy that's shapes. not too far away from Britain, in the sense that you know you still feel like you're you've got those British home comforts. Or even if you don't, you definitely need to come and check out Gibraltar. The flights are really cheap. Yes, the hotels can be pricey, but just book Amber, far ahead. Amber, what are we drinking? You tell me, but Like girl. I said, there was a Holiday Inn Express here that we stayed in last night, and it cost me 60 quid. And I booked it in advance, like you can do with Holiday Inn Express. All right, yes, the Holiday Inn Express here in Gibraltar. One side looks out to the rock, and the other side looks out to a graveyard, which isn't great, but it's cheap. You can oh, get right. some sun. Let me read out the cocktail menu for The you most all. important thing, yes. All right, thank you. Tight, I'm going to read out the cocktail Bubbles. menu for you. So we've got Sex Int Yard. Are you really going to say them just like that? Because we're yes. here all night. Because we're going to drink whatever they want us to drink. We've got just Tequila Sunrise, Pina Colada, Mojito, we've got a Cosmopolitan, we've got a Mimosa, Tinto di Verano, which is something to do, I think it's something of the summer, I think that means. Um, Aperol Spritz. French 75, a Blue Lagoon, Strawberry Daiquiri, oh I like them, Mango Daiquiri, Gimlet, a Corn Star Martini, a Rose Martini, Espresso Martini, the 69. That's a bit naughty, isn't it? So you decide what we're drinking. Hang on, we'll give you our order in a second. Sorry. I'll right. have a mojito though, because I know what I no, want. No, you've got to drink what they want you to drink. Okay, we'll just also, break. If yeah. there are any cocktails that aren't on that menu that you would like, as long as they don't have the mood thing, because we've run out, I can try and make them for you. Wow. Oh, right, fabulous. Oh, Tom Collins. My dear, that's very basic. Darren says a porn star martini. That's got coffee in it though, isn't it? That's an espresso Someone martini. Porn star is passion fruit um, and vanilla vodka. Oh yeah, that's quite nice, isn't it? Porn star mm -hmm. martini. I tell you what, it's really hard. I can't, I can't add, so I'm just going to put my finger on one. That sounds weird. And I'm just going to pick... Cosmopolitan. Yeah. A cosmopolitan it is then. Two cosmopolitan. No, you have a different one. I'll have a cosmopolitan. That hasn't got any dairy in it. Stupid question. Cosmopolitan and a porn star martini, please. I'll have the porn no star way. martini. No way, I'm gonna put my finger on it. God, see, yours. when you're married, you can't actually decide to do anything. I'm doing this for you guys, the love. You're having a blue lagoon. I'll have a blue lagoon then, please. Yeah. Thank you very much. Let's hope it's not the most expensive thing on the what menu. What I did was, I just went up the chat like that and put my finger on it and whatever it landed on, we picked. So we did it for you guys. But we would just want to say a massive oh, thank you. Oh, you about that? Oh, I, I wanted a porn star martini. Oh, I wanted an umbrella, like Del Boy. Yeah, well you ask, I'll ask him for No, 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 no. Don't, you can't ask for an umbrella. Casper, she's asking for an umbrella. Although I won't say no if, you, if they do put an umbrella. Oh, by the way, that's the casino just over there. It's uh, an Admiral Casino. I've just missed some of the chat, sorry. Gabby, I can't find her pin to get on her phone. <laughs> Tim, they do not have umbrellas with any of them, unfortunately. Wow, somebody, because someone put sex on the beach, YouTube automatically was like, no. I know, and Porn Star Marti come up and YouTube went to ban it. Strawberry Daiquiri is the best. I always go, Long Island, honestly, Craig, Long Island iced tea is, is probably dangerous. We had that once when we were in um, Greece. 
So anyway, um, if we get to say goodbye before the drinks come, we'll wait till the drinks come just before we say goodbye with Thumps as well, who's still up at 10 o'clock at night. And before you ask, no, even if we tried to put him down at 7 o'clock, he wouldn't go to bed. <laughs> Casper, have you had a good evening? Have you enjoyed it? Yeah? See, no, no, no. You've, what Gabby's doing is wrong now because he's going to think he's going to have milk. <laughs> bad, bad idea Baba. getting him out, darling. Bad idea getting him out. Oh, uh, Oh, no, is the music really clear? That, it, honestly, it doesn't actually sound that bad in here at all. But anyway, because Thumps is getting restless and because Gabby's <laughs> made the mistake by, uh, <laughs> by getting him close and if any mother's out there, he knows that it's milk time when he goes close to Gabby. When he comes to me, it's fun. When he goes to Gabby, it's ow, milk time. Ow. Ow. <laughs> so Gabby, we're going to wrap up now. Ow, we're going to wrap it. Yeah, we're going to wrap it. We're going to wrap it. We want to say thank you very much for the super chats. Thank you to the channel members. Thank you very much for the mods as well. Um, we appreciate you coming on our lives. I hope you enjoy them as much as we do because I really look forward to them and it's a, yeah, it's a great, great time to chat to the community, you guys, <laughs> to help build this channel what it is. Ow. If you want to see, if you want to see our experience, I'm getting slapped. hang on, I'm trying. Thumpies, hang on, thumpies. Daddy's working, you know. If you want to see our experience in the Sunborn um, Hotel, which is just behind us, yeah. that video is coming out on Sunday, yeah. and um, yeah, so. If you're watching it on replay, do give a thumbs up. Make sure you check out the video on Gibraltar that I did. I think it was the first year I started YouTube, actually, my tour of Gibraltar. The link is in the description. Have a wonderful evening. Good night, Gabby. Don't Say forget to follow my channel if oh, you Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gabby Starbuck. Do follow Gabby's to. channel. She will be also... Are you going to be live Monday for Coffee Morning? Yeah, I'll do it on Holly's phone. Yes. There you go. She'll be live for Show a Coffee Morning. Show must go on. So we'll say goodnight, we're going to have a drink, the drinks are taking ages, otherwise, and, and Thumps is just going to start wanting his milk. Thumps wants his cocktail too. <laughs> Do you want a cocktail? It's a boob tail. <laughs> wow, it's like we've had a drink so already and we haven't, a boob tail, that is really good. We're going to get him to bed as well. Thanks very much for watching everyone. Um, 